Uh, this forum is uh, about uh, rem uh, reduction of remittance transfer costs. Uh, it is very important for uh, senders, for African diaspora living outside the continent because they are facing, in some cases, a lot of challenges in terms of uh, remittance transfers. Not in terms of regulation only, but also in terms of uh, cost. They face a lot of, uh, a very high uh, transfer cost when it comes to remit remitting money in, 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 in Africa. Uh, sure, it's not for all corridors, but for many co corridors uh, between the uh, sending countries, in whether it is Europe, America, or uh, the Middle East, you will have uh, our citizens uh, facing a lot of challenges in terms of uh, remittance transfers. The challenges in terms, uh, in terms of accessibility, do they, have, do they always have access to the financial services? Uh, do, are they authorized to do so? In some cases, they might be, in some other cases, it might be very, very difficult for them to have access to varieties of uh, uh, services. When you have some corridors where the only options available are banks and probably when people have to walk into uh, uh, an office to do their transactions, it might be very challenging for them because they also have to face the, do their job and their work and all these things. What we are uh, adv uh, 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 advocating for is that for remittance senders have multitude of so many uh, alternatives, mainly digital alt alternatives, so that they can send remittance from wherever they are. And also that we look at the requirements when it comes to uh, K uh, KYC, know your customer, such as that are not that, in, uh, that, 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 that stringent that uh, really hinder the, 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 the uh, uh, remittance transfer costs.